Thank you for being with us, for being with our community on the commemoration of this devastating day. I'm going to chant the prayer, El Malay Rachamim, God Full of Mercy, which is a prayer that the Jewish community chants at memorial services, at funerals, and on the year anniversary of an individual's death. El Malay Rachamim, Shochem Bam Romim, Hamsei Menucha Nechona, Kanfei Hashchina, Malot Kedoshim Tehorim the Giburim Kezohar Harakia Meirim Umazirim Lenishmot Hakedoshim Escher Israel Anashim Nashim Vataf Shenehergu Venitrehu Shenisrefu Venit Behu Masru Nafsham Al Kedush Hashem Beris Derot Kvaraza Nachal Oz Reim near him again, Sufa near Yitzchak, near Oz Kerem Shalom O Fakim, and Hashlosha Moshav, Yahini Nativ Asara Holit, U Festival Nova Bavor Shana Sheanumit Palalim. Leilu and Ishmotehem began Eden to Hemenu Khatam. Lachen Baal Harachamim Yasti Rain Beseter Kinafa Olamim. The Yitz Roar Beats were a Chaim at Nishmo Tehem. Adonai Hunachla Tam, Via Nuhu Vishaloma Mishkavo Tam, Vinomar Amen. God, full of mercy, who dwells on high, grant fitting rest on the wings of the divine presence to the holy and pure, the brave, for the souls of the holy ones, men, women, and children who were killed on October 7th. For this we pray for the ascent of their souls, may they rest in the Garden of Eden. May you shelter them in the shadow of your wings forever, and may their souls be bound up in the bond of everlasting life. May they rest in peace, and we say amen. We're now gonna light the Yorkside candle, the memorial candle, and then observe a moment of silence. President Biden marking one year since the Hamas terror attack on Israel. 1,200 people were killed that day, the deadliest day for Jews since the Holocaust. Israel estimated roughly 100 hostages are still in Gaza. They believe roughly half of those are still alive.